Hello everyone. Welcome. Uh, so we're going to uh, finish up as much of this randomizer as we can in the next uh, hour or two. Uh, thank you for joining me um, here on the, the uh, Game Vault uh, podcast um, stream. Sorry. I'm just looking some things up. Um, for some reason, my uh, Google Chrome crashed. Uh, right before I started this, because it would not be a stream without us having issues. So, alright. There we go. Alright. I just had to load up the tracker again. So, for those of you that didn't join us last time, um, for some reason I picked a swordless run. Um, so, we had to... Um, Go the first hour or so without actually having a um, sword at all. So, but we were able to get through that. We found a bunch of stuff right at the end of the stream. And we are going to plow forward now. And I should be able to beat some dungeons. So, let me just get this started up. Get my tracker reloaded. Here with everything I have. You know, because this is going to be very important. Um, and then I got to do a quick um, map check as well. Yeah, I think the last thing we got was the glove right at the end there. Um, this should open a whole bunch of stuff for us. I just gotta find out where the uh, where the lantern is, and then I should be pretty good into um, you know getting to pieces of the um, of the map that I can't really get to right now. I think I have everything loaded, so let's rejoin. All right, uh, we're gonna start just at the house. Nice and center. I have a sword. Look at that sword. Yay. Uh, so, let's see. I'm trying to remember where I have been. I could... Let's see. Let's go up to Zora. I think I can get enough coins by the time I get up to Zora. To get to the 500. Especially now that I can lift big rocks. Um, yes, yeah, so if you have any questions, um, Tom is in chat. So he can answer them for you. Um, he was with me last time as we struggled through this. I just need five more coins. Give me that blue rupee. Nope. Yeah, so gotta head up to the. Oh, well, that works out. To the witch's hut. I wish I had the memory that some speedrunners and randomizer runners have where they can tell you exactly what each enemy drops, just so I don't waste my time. Alright, four more coins. Almost the full health, too. Oh, of course. Three more coins. Alright, let's just get to that 500. There we go. Alright, let's go meet Zora. And see what he has for us. Uh, pretty low. I'm going to assume it's going to be coins. If he has the bow, I will be really, really excited. Because then that means I can beat Eastern. And get one dungeon down. 
I don't think I can beat any dungeon right now. I can get to some of the chest in um, Tower of Hera. And I can get some places in... Well, I basically cleared out what I could of Eastern. There's a piece of heart there that'll get me an, another heart. Because I'm currently at 11 pieces. So we'll swing back around and get that. Because that'll at least... Even if he has shit here... That would at least make the trip worthwhile. Yeah. The one advantage to a randomizer is that I already have the flippers, so I don't have to worry about the uh, staying on the path of the shallow water. Ah, level 2 sword! That might even be better. That is the master sword. Ha ha! Let's go down there. Huzzah! That is amazing. <laughs> That'll make everything from here on out, whenever I go inside those dungeons, much, 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 much easier. Alright, let's drop down here. Just make sure... No, there's nothing missing here. Alright, let's go uh, back to the Tower of Hera. Oh, can I not get it? I thought I could be grabbed in the... Oh, whatever. I'll just get on land. Have I not opened the bird yet? Do you remember, Tom? Oh, yeah. I thought I did. All right, I think we should be good now. Okay, Tom. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's get up to the Tower of Hera. So, best case scenario for Tower of Hera is that the chest has the bow or the lantern because that allows us to finish uh, let me give myself the second sword because the funniest thing about this is that the only th place i can beat right now is i can go beat agonum you know, the the final boss before going into the the dark world. Alright. Do I have the big key here yet? So we can just go right upstairs. I don't have to go downstairs. Unless if we don't end up having the... Ah, it feels so good to be able to kill these things in two hits. Ooh, I don't have a net either. Yeah. There we go. I should be on the right square to kind of just run through all this. I think I might even be able to beat him. I think. It's a pain in the balls, but... Yeah. Ah, it's so nice having... Here, go full magic. All right, let's go upstairs, fall down, and see what's in the big chest here. Oh, I forgot, I gotta.
Ah, the third sword! <laughs> Okay. Does does nothing to help me advance. It just makes things a lot easier to kill. Alright, let's go fight my arch nemesis. God, I hate him so much. Tail always follows the head. It's, it's the way to fight him. Hey! Well, when you have the third sword in the game, I guess. Worthless. First dungeon down. Woo! Uh, so yeah, so having the third leveled sword in the game kind of makes him a little bit of a joke if you're not paying attention. So, let's see. Can I do anything else yet? So, is that a... Let me see, was that a... Yeah, that was a 5-6. There we go, he's done. Let's see. I could fear now I'm not even gonna try that without the thing. Hmm. Let's explore a little bit. Get the hammer, right? That opens up so much more. I can actually... Yeah, I can go take care of... I can go to the dark world. What's in here? I forget what's in here. I think this is a cave. That has something. Probably best bet is to go to the dark world right now. I'm gonna try and jump in that cave. I think I've been in both of these. Oh no, I can actually do... Let's go to the dark world. I apologize if that was in your ear, guys. Hundred coins, completely useless. Alright, this is a save and quit situation. Because <laughs> I am not making it back across them spikes. So, typically, when you're playing through the the main game, um...
the, um, you would have the cape there to go invisible. So, that makes it a lot easier. I think I can get Hype Cave now. Let me see. Yeah, I should be, yeah, I should be able to do Hype Cave, and then I should knock off two dungeons while I'm here. Pipe cave is this cave right here has I forget exactly how many chests in it, but it's I think it's the second highest in terms of chests in here. He gives you something. He just gave me bombs, which is nice. All right, hype cave time, guys! Lantern! Woo! It's a good first pull. Cape? That's a great second pull. Full heart? Can we go four for four? What do you think, guys? Four for four? Are we going to be able to get a fourth item here that's useful? Nope! <laughs> Just ten arrows. Three for four is still pretty damn good. So that opens up a lot. Um, let me go out of here and do a map check. So, oh, we don't have to do Ice Palace, probably, or Turtle Rock. Awesome. Or Skull Woods. So there's three pendants. Two of them are two of the hardest dungeons in the game. So we don't even have to do those. It's awesome. This number seven here, that is probably the hardest one for me. That's one that I was falling asleep on during Extra Life doing. That's Misery Mire. It's the one where the hand comes down and grabs you. Um, so yeah, so let's go get three and six here, which is awesome. Then we can go get the bomb and check out that. Um, so, all right, let's go. So we'll go take out Swamp Palace right now. Which should be a little bit of a piece of cake with this sword. I say that now and it'll take me forever. So. I may, depending on how lucky I get, if I get the arrows soon, or the bow, I should say, and the silver arrows. I should be able to be getting pretty close to... I may be able to do it in the stream, not 100% sure. But it'll be close. It'll just depend on what I pull out of here and uh, the thieves hide out. Oh yeah, we definitely need to start planning that soon. Ah. Thank you, iframes. That helps. I gotta say, guys, that was the best hype cave I've had. Alright. 
fill up the water here, and then you're able to swim over to the other side. This is... The best thing about this is you're not supposed to have the hook shot at this point. Because you get the hook shot in this cavern. So it makes traversing this a little easier. I love getting arrows without a bow. It's one of my favorite things. You play it a lot, Tom. Nah. Alright. So. I'm hoping for the big key very, very soon. Fairy. God damn it. There we go. Yeah, I was kind of hoping. Alright. Fill that water back up. Yeah, it's one of those things where if you... It's like you in Final Fantasy VII. You beat a game enough, you get to learn. I beat... The, you know, vanilla way, non-randomizer, probably close to two dozen times. Oh, that's sweet. thing I'm not great at. Uh, my favorite dungeon... Hmm. I do... Uh, oh, no, I can get over there. Forgot that I have the hook shot. Um, I like the Palace of Darkness a lot. Completely useless. And I used that thing, so now I gotta take the long way back. Awesome. Um, Palace of Darkness, which is the first one in this one, it has the big, um, the turtle with the mask on that you have to destroy with the hammer. Ah, uh, it sucks having to take the long way. Oh, I can't anyway. Oh, I'm having a hell of a time. Alright, I need to go... Change the... Oh, that's pretty sweet. How do I get over there? Oh, I know how to get over there. Mm -hmm. Idiot. Alright, so we're looking for... Ah. Technically, that's a ladder. That's why they won't let you... Dark World dungeons are probably more some of the more memorable ones. And they're also the ones I'm not the best at because 
I've played the three Light World ones a lot more as I've been trying to speedrun. So I'm pretty good at the... As you saw, I just went through Tower of Hera like that. Alright. I decided to take my good old time getting there. Alright, let's see what's in here first. Big key! That's huge. Some would say it's big. Alright, let's see what's in big... The chest? Once you get the big key, it usually means you don't have to check out any of the other chests most of the time. So getting an early big key is, is a good sign. That's what happened in the Tower of Hera. Now there have been times when I needed to go back into dungeons I've beaten because some random chest had a very important item in it, but it's very few and far between. Fire Rod. Even though I don't need to go there, I would have needed that for Skull Wood. Fuck, I need a small key. I think I know where it is. I'm gonna die. Yep. Ugh. It's actually good. I kind of wanted to go back towards the beginning. this way. Not the right way. No. I I don't know why he's the only one that respawns there. Heart. 
This isn't a bad water temple. As far as water temples go. Boss time. This should be relatively quick. Almost had him. I think I had one more hit. Alright, just kind of dance around that. Because if I swing, that one thing will attack me. I don't have the net yet. I caught some of those fairies. I think I gotta just not be an idiot. That's fucking awesome. I'm glad I came that way. That's a full health restore. And magic. Not that I really need magic. I think one of these moves... 
the hell of it. Nice. Alright, full health and a full restore. It should be pretty... so much for that full health. But I should be a little bit better. I over... I wasn't as careful as you should be. I was trying to beat him too quickly. I should never get hit during this phase. made so much more progress in just this. Sorry, I'm just doing something here. Screen and... Alright. Oh, and the other thing to mention, the, uh, the two castles that I, the two dungeons I do not need to do. Or I'm sorry, scratch that. The which six? It's blind. Okay. Ah, uh, hopefully I don't need earthquake for that one that I need to do. So, all right, let's go. Let's go do bo oh, that's not the way I want to go. Let's go back into the light world. I want to clear out some stuff that I can do now. Go take the bottle to the kid. Give me the bow. Oh, useless. You're useless, kid. Alright, so I did that. I can do... See if it's even worth it. I need the book, is what I need. Thank you. 
Yeah, if needed. I can I can defeat Agon and come back and do that. But we'll see. We'll see. Oh, no, that is actually worth it. Shit. <laughs> shit, shit, shit. Uh, should I go beat Agon? Hmm. Let me go get the cane of Samara first. I'd have to do it the long way, wouldn't I? Crap. Okay. Uh... Let's save and quit. I think I can get to it from this way. I can make blocks. Death Mountain real fast. <laughs> now I'm gonna die, because I wasn't paying attention. Alright. So him heal me up. I wanna go do a Apparently I can go do Spiral Cave now, if I remember correctly. <laughs> God, I hate these rocks. Go 
Urban Trout Spiral. If I got the glove. This is Spiral Cave. Yep. I think that's the one thing the randomizer has done for me. That the, uh... That the main game did not point through. Is knowing where all these caves are. slightly boring part of the game, I want to check some things off to make sure I'm not missing anything. After I go do this, I'm going to go uh, defeat Blind. It's one of my least favorite castles. Excuse me, or dungeons, I should say. Oh, I should go talk to this guy, too. Right. Yeah. Let's see what he gives me. Bo, Bo. God damn it, I don't need any money. Let's go back to the dark world. Let's go get this stuff over here. 
clear out blind, then that'll probably be the night. So we're hoping for book or bow. I would even take the, uh... Not 300 coins. I need to get all seven crystals, which is... I need five more of those. Before we can fight Ganon. So. We'll definitely come back next week. Because I can currently... Depending on what, I'm assuming that over by blind, there's going to be something. Because it's the only castle I can do right now. Outside of uh, Skull Woods. But I don't really have to want to go to Skull Woods unless I absolutely have to. Alright, let's get the treasures in here. There's the one over here. It should always be the second chest I get. That works. So that's done. Let's go open blind here. And then the other thing is... Is a sea house here, if I remember. Yes. I mean, this all helps. <laughs> Especially since I still have level 1 armor. Um, so, it, yeah, that guy looks very familiar, doesn't he? Right there. do this yet. I think I can do this. No, not yet. But I can do the shovel game down here. Can't do him yet. Let's go do the shovel game. Can I jump? 
Well, I actually do want to go up here. Is this something? No. I think we have the thing up here where I throw the skull. Alright, sorry to be wasting everyone's time here. Let's go up here. Saving and quitting. That was disappointing. Yeah, I want to be here. I do have to check one thing before we do the shovel. I want to see if it's worth it to feed Aghanim. See what's on the pyramid. Yeah. Oh, that's right. You gotta go the long way, because normally when you walk the bomb through here, So the bomb I keep talking about is the giant bomb you get that, um, you can't, um, can't sprint with it. Can I get it now? I don't think I can get that item now. Maybe I can. Oh yeah, I didn't even need to check. It's a piece of heart. So I don't need to beat Aghanim. Serious, unless if... Unless we desperately need it. That's the giant bomb. Alright, let's... Let's go do the shovel puzzle. And then we'll go fight blind. God, I need. I really need that bow. The bow is an end game item. Damn it. 
I'm going to do this again. Silver arrows! Nice. Ah, let's see what else I can get. I believe there's normally a piece of heart here. Oh, it gives me the arrows, too. Awesome. Nice. I thought that was the silver arrows it was giving me, but it was giving me the bow. All right. Let's, uh... Let's go take care of an easy boss. Let's go take care of Eastern, since I have to do it anyway. I probably could have went to five. That may have been the better choice. <laughs> I'm excited I don't have to do the Ice Palace. The only downside to not doing the Ice Palace is that I don't get to show off the one bomb jump that I know in this game. But, it would be a waste of time. Yeah, I chose this one because this is the easiest dungeon in the game. It is the first dungeon. And this would be the progress blocker if you didn't get the bow. You can't kill those red ones without the bow. Wish I had silver arrows here, though. So lucky, I didn't think that would work. Alright, I think it's 
All right, let's get all 30 arrows and let's beat it. Almost got it in one cycle. Ah, that might be the most useless item to find in a boss fight. So glad we got the map. This is the quick way in, right? I can't get this way yet, right? Yeah, I can. Okay. Awesome. Apples. This means I gotta take the long way out of here. We have not... We, we got the Master Sword. We're, we're on the third level of sword. Awesome. Get some defense. There are four. We have the the last sword, which is um, known in the community of people that run this game as the butter sword, because it's a yellow sword, so it kind of looks like a stick of butter. Big key. Those are good back-to-back -back chests there. Alright, I think I got three or four pieces. It's a good haul in here so far. I can pretty much bypass most of this by having a big key. This is the worst. 
And I gotta go back. Oh no, I can just do this. Oh yeah, I do. The big chest is up here. And I gotta... I gotta bomb the light in. For the one trick of this dungeon. Let's go get the princess that's in here, who is totally not a fake bad guy. That's the way to the boss room. I think the big chest is in the room to the left here. Yes. Okay, let's see what's in here and then we can go fight blind. Useless. Nope. This is... Totally not a bad guy. Nope, not. There is a trick to blind. I have not figured out his pattern yet. I should do really well with two full helves redone and a full bar here. But he does the same pattern every time. stuff in there. So that is three down. All 
I am getting more and more nervous that I am, it's going to be a pedestal. Run. Alright, uh, let's see. Do I have to do... Yeah, I do have to do Palace of Darkness. Alright, let's do Palace of Darkness. Take a semi long way. little asshole that I get here sort of cons me out of money. I can't get hit once while I have him here. Which is a lot easier with the current sword I have. So I pay him hundred uh, rupees to open this door for me. And we're in Palace of Darkness. A second bomb jump here. I can do this. Yes. Let's check the hint out. Wish I could remember what the paradox game was. I probably was already there. guys mimic your movements. This is a chest over here. And since I have the cane... Yes! The 
book is huge. That'll be a way I can go test out if it's a, uh, a pedestal run or not. Yeah, let's go beat the boss. <laughs> and then come back in the castle. I don't have the big key. Shit. <laughs> that was the boss story, ladies and gentlemen. back in through that way. I still need the big key.
Alright, let's go get the big chest. Yeah, there is a bomb jump that I could have done. But I'm not even good at it. And I don't feel like boring you guys any more than I owe. Than you may already be. Check this out. I'm not sure this is about anything. It's just the map. Alright, get my bombs out. There we go. And the red boomerang! fun way. Let's use up all the items I got. Nope. Would have missed those red rubies if I didn't come back this way. Alright. Best part about this run so far... what I get for trying to be fancy. Let's do it. Boss time. And... Let's see. Let's 
Boss down. Let's see what he gives me. Oh, I knew it wasn't going to be anything important. All right, so shit leaves me with two more. All right. Let's go do the very important thing that we should do here. I'm going to knock out one more dungeon. Because I can do the second dungeon in here now. Alright. Let's hope it's not a pedestal run, guys. Because then that means we have... I have to do ice. See, is it a pedestal run? All right. Don't have to do the ice temple. All right, now that we have the book, we can go check out two places before we have to go to Misery Mire. Let's head up here. God damn it. Somehow I got hurt. All right, we go check out the the uh, tome up here. See if that has anything. And then we go beat Desert Palace, and then we will be done for the stream. Second level shield. Nice. I 
would probably need to go... Right. Let's go Dark World. Grab that there. No, I had the cane of Samaria. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Let's go check the second tome. Also kill that bird. Nice. Well, oh no, she flew out. Nice. Here. I love to get half magic or the powder. I think that's really the only me and the second glove. I think are really the only major things I'm missing right now. I need the second glove to finish the game. go time. It opens up so much more of the game. I don't know what that means. Alright, let's go check this chest. Because I still need a key. My suspicion is this chest will have a key. I got the big key. I gotta check the big key chest. Shit, I need a key. Oh, no. No, I'm good. I'm an idiot. Right. 
Nope, lower right. Lower left. I'm just gonna take him out to make it easier. On a speed run, you would try and do it without moving him. And this way I can use the least amount of magic. Alright, let's do it. I think I'll beat him straight up with a sword. I've been trying to do the arrow strat. With an upgraded sword, this should be no problem. Another one down. And he gave me a third bottle. I'll give myself the third bottle and I'll mark off. Yeah. Yeah, this this entire game is amazing in terms of graphical fidelity and all that. Alright, so. One final thing before we end. We're going to check out what medallion we need to get into Misery Mire. I went to the wrong thing. Alright, let's see what medallion we need. Yes, and we have it. Let's open this. And then I want to do one other thing. I want to do the... The two things we can do down here. Or the... I'm sorry, the one place I can go down here. At this chest. And then do you guys want to see the giant bomb? I, I can go do the giant bomb now. Alright. Let's go do the giant bomb. Completely useless here. Or at least we X that off. Yeah, I put myself on a wall. Alright. Alright, let's go do the giant bomb. I doubt there's gonna be anything in the uh, giant bomb cave. But 
worth a shot. And also since I have about 10 minutes left anyway. Actually, I'll do, since this is the end of the stream, I'll do a couple cleanup stuff I have to do. This and do the, um, the swordsman. There's the giant bomb. Now, I can't get hit, jump, or run while I have this attached to me. It's always best to do this with full hearts. All right. All right, let's see what's in there. Ten arrows. Twenty coins. Like I said, completely useless. Yay. Rescue the frogman, the chest. Do the uh... All right, we'll rescue the frogman. We we'll do the chest. Hammer thing. I gotta get the powder. And the net. Frogman. Turn to blacksmith. Step out. Back in. Ten arrows. When I go back, there should be a chest in here. Take it over here to the man who's quiet all the time. And he opens it for you. And it was useless. Alright, what are the other things I can do? <laughs> go back. 
here. Thank you for letting me know. Now I can take the shortcut through here. Shot cave. Motherfucker. Oh, you can have those. I don't really care. There's a way to do this faster. You can item run or something that's called. That'll give me a heart. Alright, no. I have. Alright, now I have. Let's see. Yeah, let's. Let's go up to the mountain. And do that stuff. Shot cave here, and this is where we'll end it. That's fine. So far, not as great as Hype Cave. 
Yes, magic powder. Awesome. That means I want to do one more thing. I swear there's more chests in here. Oh, that's what this leads to. Now nah, that was completely useless. I'm interested in something. What is Turtle Rock's thing? We had them both, so it wouldn't have mattered anyway. Hopefully, I don't have to go there. Why can't I get in turtle rock? I should have everything. Sword, shield, this, Anus Moria. Ice rod, I need the ice rod. So just to let you guys see, before I go do the one last thing I'm doing, this is Ganon's Tower. This is the eighth dungeon we have to beat. So. Alright, let's, uh, let's go back and do the one last thing I need, I want to do. Go meet our bat friend. Actually, I'm gonna do one other thing too. I just wanna clean up a lot of these little things here. Oh, I'm missing is the last crystal for go time. I mean, that works. Uh, in the base game, that's where you get half magic. Which would have been nice. But I'm gonna try one more thing. I know I keep saying I'm gonna end this. But there's so much little shit I gotta clean up. We'll leave Misery Mire, Ganon's Tower. And the, um... And the final boss fight with Ganon. For next time.
And there's half magic. Awesome. Nice. That is the perfect way to end it. Let's see, is there any other little things before I... No, nothing that I really want to check out right now. Worst case would be if I need to go inside of any of the dungeons that I still have to go inside. No, I have everything. I have the silver arrows. Yeah, I'm just going to check something on the tracker real fast. Yep, so, as it says in our tracker, next time, it is go time. We beat Misery Meyer, we go to Ganon's Tower, and then we beat Ganon. So join us, that may take under an hour next time, so maybe I'll have a second game um, lined up um, for us. Um, Plan would be Sunday night. Um, so be on the lookout. I will let the Twitter know if Sunday night will work. Um, weekend's kind of crazy for me. Uh, but definitely next Thursday, um, we will finish this game. Um, and then we'll see what we do from there. Maybe we, um, I don't know. I have, I have some hours in Super Mario RPG that I did before. Maybe we'll play that for the classic playthrough. Or maybe we find something else. I might I might throw a poll up in the chat, and we'll see we'll see what to what to do like on the Twitters and all um, with a bunch of games. So um, thank you guys for joining us. Um, it has been a fun time. Uh, this was a much better stream than the last time that we did this uh, when I spent an hour looking for a sword. Now we have the third sword, we have the second shield, we're go time, um, just gotta beat, um, Misery Meyer, which might be the, my least favorite dungeon, but one of the easier bosses, when you're leveled up at, like this. Um, I might go around to a few other things, if Misery Meyer does not have the fourth sword, um, I can still beat Ganon with the third sword, but I would, I would like to have the butter sword, so... Um, go fill up, uh, I would love to have the bug catching net so I can have a lot of fairies, but, um, if we don't get the bug catching net, um, in Misery Mire or Ganon's Tower, um, I will just go fill up on, um, I might just fill up my bottles anyway, just in case. Um, and then if we get the bug catching net, I can just take them and then catch the fairies from there. So, anyway, that strategy we'll talk about next time. So, thank you for joining me. Uh, we'll be back. Um, I think, uh, if we have another stream, it'll be on Saturday, because this is a recording week, um, but we might not. Um, probably most likely we'll be back on Tuesday, uh, with our, um, Retro Roulette game for this week's podcast. So, first news for all of you guys out there, um, the podcast will be delayed today. Um, just things came up where we couldn't all get together to record in time for a Monday, so it'll go up on Tuesday. I'm sure it'll be up on the Twitter um, as it gets closer, but yeah, look out for that, so thank you guys again and let's get hyped to beat Ganon next time <laughs>